some gorgeous weather out there to play some flag football. Turning back to KCRA 3 weather now, and wow. we want to show you this a live look from our Lake Tahoe sky camera. Just a beautiful day there. You can see a break in the clouds, some darker clouds moving in as well. Meteorologist Dirk Verdorn is here now for a look ahead of what we can expect overnight. Yeah, those guys look a little angry there. Mm -hmm. We've got some darkness that's off in the distance and some showers that are going to be moving in and developing as we go through the night tonight. So right now we do have a live look here from our Rancho Cordova sky camera. You can see the clouds that are out there and the bottom's not completely flat. You can see a little undulating going on there. That's moving up and down. We have temperature 60 degrees in Sacramento, 62 in Stockton, 61 Modesto, and currently 39 degrees at Lake Tahoe. High temperatures reached into the 40s for Lake Tahoe and Truckee. Got 43 degrees and 41 degrees. Got into 50s in Auburn and Placerville, 60s in the Valley. Got to 67 degrees today in Stockton, 64 in Sacramento, 62 in Marysville, 64 in Fairfield, and 61 degrees was the daytime high in San Francisco. So weather systems moving in. You can see the cloud cover coming with it, and the rain is close behind. This rain is going to move through overnight tonight and into early, early tomorrow morning. But then there's another system behind that one. We're expecting to have that arriving by Monday night and into Tuesday. So this second one looks like it may be a little bit more vigorous than the first one coming through. So here's your precipitation comparison here. The rain and the snow for the one tonight and into tomorrow. We're looking anywhere from, uh, you know, uh, three hundredths of an inch up to a fifteen hundredths of an inch in the valley. So not a lot of rain. Sierra, we're looking at one to four inches over the passes. And so that could pose a problem if you're traveling and there may be chain controls associated with that. But as we get into Monday and the Tuesday, Monday night and the Tuesday, we're looking at anywhere from five hundredths uh, in the valley to up to thirty five hundred. So again, the farther north you go in the valley, you're going to be getting a little bit more from Yuba City, Marysville on towards Chico and then Red Bluff and Redding. So a little bit more the higher you go. And then we're looking at three to six inches of snow over the passes. So future cash showing the timing of this again that rain coming in tonight. Here's 11 o'clock midnight. We'll see that and then we get past one, two o'clock and then we just have some lingering showers even in the Sierra. Just some showers left over through the morning hours and into the afternoon. And then the next wave comes in Monday night. Here's 830 PM and then we'll have some showers turning a little bit heavier as we get closer to midnight. So these are timing right there during the overnight hours. Perfect. If you don't want to have to deal with the rain, you just want to sleep through it. it looks like that is timing is pretty good. Now as we go through Tuesday, we still may see some lingering showers in the valley through the foothills and on into the Sierra with most of that activity staying in the mountains. Then we clear out and we're looking at mostly sunny skies as we head through Wednesday. Here we are noontime and we are looking at just a few high thin clouds and temperatures that will be warming your Sierra forecast. Here's a look at your numbers for tomorrow. Again, chance for some showers will be there. We're not looking at a lot of precipitation, but temperatures in the 40s for daytime highs and through the foothills. How about these temperatures in the 50s? For daytime high temperatures, so maybe about the same as today, if not a little bit cooler possible. Bay Area is 59 in San Francisco, 60 in Napa and Fairfield, 63 degrees. The so temperatures down a little bit there. 65 in Stockton, 64 in Manteca, and 62 degrees for a daytime high in Tracy. And temperatures into the Sacramento Valley, ranging from Roseville, 64, Yuba City, 63, and Davis warming up to 63 degrees. Your seven-day forecast. Again, we are looking at uh, that little unsettled pattern through Tuesday and then things clear out Wednesday. Look at these temperatures warming up into the 70s. And the thing about this one is that it's going to last. You know, we've seen some little spikes in temperatures, mm -hmm. but this one looks like it's going to last for mm. several days.